I'm Murray Noodles, the Search Engine Journal. I'm here in Las Vegas at PubCon with Danny. Danny, you do infographics. How are you doing? Yeah, good. Um, my first time at PubCon and yeah, I'm having a really good time and enjoying Vegas. It's cool. Okay, so infographics, they were super hot a couple yeah. of years ago. That seems to, the trend seems to have quieted down a little bit from what I've seen. What are the latest trends with infographics and content marketing? Okay, well, uh, obviously we've moved away from an area where infographics would work, just any infographic. Yeah. And we're kind of moving to kind of a point now where infographics have to be a certain level of quality to kind of reach, get the placements on the big sites. Right. So I'm seeing within the, in the market and the providers, then we're kind of getting, there's a smaller number, but the ones that are left are the, are the good ones and they're the ones who are providing good stuff. In regards to kind of future where it's moving, our agency is heavily invested into kind of HTML5, uh, whether and infographics that have actual practical value. We see we know that's like kind of one of the main factors with shareability, and that's something that we're seeing probably in the next year. Also, with the kind of smaller style, not so long form graphics, or the the ones that can be shared kind of more easily on like social media and what have you. So that's where it's going. But I don't, you know, as a, as an agency, we just keep increasing and, and seeing more and more clients. So I don't think there's a and there's definitely still a demand for it there. What are some tips for creating a great infographic? Uh, I think for any infographic, if you want, if, especially if you want kind of links and placements, yeah. then the, the number one thing that has the most importance isn't design or research or outreach, it's the idea. And, yeah. and spending that time, uh, we spend around five to six hours cumulative time with the whole team coming up with the ideas. And if that idea is right, and this is especially when I kind of first started, I used to you know, get cheap, cheap design, cheap research. It, it still works and you still get those placements. So spend that time on the idea and then you know, then you can save money on the rest of the stuff. It's the concept. The concept, yeah, and he has, has to care about it. I mean, there's a great book uh, called Contagious by Jonah Berger, yeah. um, where he has kind of identifies the main factors why people share something. And what we try and do is define any of our ideas and see if they match up to one of those. So do they have a trigger? Do they have an emotional hook? Have they got practical value? And if, if it has, then it's gonna work really, really well. Fantastic, if people wanna find out more, and connect with you. What's your email address, please? Uh, so Danny, uh, D-A-N-N-Y, at neomam.com, and it's N-E-O-M-A-M.com. Danny, thank you very much. Have a great show. Cheers, thank you. I'm Murray Newells with Search Engine Journal. I'll see you next time.